make here if you're a creator. So first of all, we're, we're going to pick out what hair we want to deviate from. So if we go to shop, box catalog, I'm just going to pick any kind of hair, but you can pick anything you want. And I'm going to be from female for female Ivy. Also works for male and whatnot. So, let me see. I'll pick this. And make sure you, when you go to pick a deviated, to deviate from something, you have to go to deviation tree. And make sure you're getting the best um, one for your, for your credit. Because the more deviated they're from, the um, higher they get. And like I said, this one is deviated from this. So I want to go to this one. Because it's cheaper to deviate from. I'm going to go to the URL bar. And I'm going to copy that, um, that link. I'm going to go to IMVU, create a tab right here, deviate from new product, and I want you to do hold control and press V to control paste, and go. Once that loads, while that's loading, you go here, and this is when I finish this finished product, but we're gonna start from the basics. Go to file, new, and I want you to make the width and length 250 by 250 with the height. In the template, don't worry about that, but make sure it's um 250 by 250 and you push OK. OK. And now this, it definitely, if it's not black already, like, if this wasn't black, I would take one of these and just drop it there and go to image mode and keep it on grayscale. Yours will be around, probably on um, RGB, but I want to make sure you put it on grayscale. I don't care what color you're making your hair, that's the color it has to be for now. And now go to filters, go to noise. And her, and keep the repeat down at one. Um, put this up to around 22, 20. You can have anything you want, but I, that's a good one to have it at. And now that now that's here, go to filters, blur, and go to motion blur. Okay. And when you do this motion blur, have this, the length, all the way up to how far it will go up, all the way to the right. Like, if you want, if you don't want it, but I keep mine up higher, so it looks, looks actually real. So you can do it right here, like, I'll do it 110 for now. And the angle, put it at 90 degrees, because if you don't, the angle is going to be wrong and your hair has to go straight down and sit down so keep this at 90. Once you have that, I'm at 110 and 90 right now. Push OK. Now, you see this? That's how we want it to be. I'm going to control save and save this one. I'll save it as hair. It's for JPEG. Then this is just showing you what it will look like. Okay, now I want to go back to IMVU, and I really don't like having my avatar like this, so I'll just change it, pick an outfit and put it on, because you get to see how it really looks on a avatar, and nobody walks around looking like a noob, unless you're really a noob, so it's really, really good to change that, and that's right there, so go here, edit, and the hair I just made. I saved it as here, so just click on that and apply changes. As you can see, you see the strands, the pronounced, and everything. But 
this is too light. So I'm going to go back here to GIMP. And I'm going to change color, brightness, contrast. And for the contrast, stop some brightness down a bit until you get the color coloration that you want to push OK. And then I'm going to save this again and go back and show you the difference. very very much improved very nice and this is the end of um, making your hair very basic but you can also put highlights in it I'll show you that in the next video but for now basic that's how you make hair